No, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. Easy there. Don't oh, we're back at yet. Big V's. Vic? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Almost done stabilizing the biochip. Yeah, this. I was gonna say this feels like very familiar. Using your head as a knife block. How? How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time <laughs> off the table. And demanded you be treated immediately. Yeah, sounds right. Element was your guardian angel. Huh? Oh. Uh, Did we say that out loud? Myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up carefully. Okay, I don't expect a miracle. Ah, sit slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. Hmm. Well, say it. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah, what about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudoendotrys in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Ooh. Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Man! Endotrizine. Rogue Sokka Tower. Oh! Only way this is gonna work. Enough, Johnny. I just. Do we give him control? It. Need to stretch, stretch your noodle. Fine. Fine. Just not, it's in, not this in this basement. basement. Whoa. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Yeah, I got problems. Out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Uh, I think I can do it. Okay. We both knew this time would come. If we don't think of something quick, you'll die and I'll go with you. It's time for our final meeting. Uh... <laughs> wow. What do we do? Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Say, who won the bout? Oh, so you heard that. Did he get up? Walsh, was it? No, nope. never does. Meaning? It's a rerun. One I'd huh. like to go back to. Why'd you get so mad then? If you already knew who won. Oh no, really. Guess I like to think about where Walsh might have tripped up. Any theories? Entering the ring against a stronger opponent, but feels a little strange to call that a mistake. Can't thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. 
Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. So. Do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there, too. Good luck, kid. So it seems like <laughs> we need to make a decision about who we want to give control to. Um, we're not doing super well. Johnny uh, might have kind of like that killer instinct that we could benefit from, but... Let's see. Hey V, I heard. Well, your thoughts. I was saying them out loud. To. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on, and I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Yeah, that's cool, actually. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. <laughs> Plus, he's had too much coffee. Gotta hear when you get those blocked up guess. chakras. My aura is sputtering. Mm hmm. Afraid so. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. That's actually so cool. If we get some little insights into Jackie here, I would love that. Top floor. I'm like basically on my deathbed and I'm still face. hitting elevator buttons. Oh, Jack. This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but he found the courage to bet on himself. After, I brought him here. What could there be that would really uh, that's more like it. impact it Air. so much? See that? Yeah, what are we looking at? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. That's cool. She's onto something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. Near on unachievable these days. So what... What did Jackie decide of here? Oh, you know gonna be a legend in this city and I'm gonna leave you alone now take your time fucking scared me know that thought you were on your way out I thought it was too no still here for now you know should call anyone you want to say goodbye to Oh, cool. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Sweet. So, is it only Pan Am I could call? I felt like maybe I'd be able to call Judy... Uh, maybe call Carrie. I'm calling Pan Am. Or maybe this is only people that we've Pan Am. had like a full on relationship with. Voice. Sure as hell hope it's that and only that. 
Hmm. Hey. Pan Am, hey. Do you know what time it is? <laughs> S sorry to wake you this late. Is that why you called? To apologize for interrupting? Oh, she's gonna feel sleep. really bad in a second. To know that we'll see each other again. What? You know, fine. Fuck no, off. no, not like that. Make up your mind. Huh. Something. Something I gotta do today. Gonna be high risk, big time, but I have to. What is it? It's not for comms. Not really. Then shut up and tell me where you are. In the city? Yeah. Okay, then plant your butt somewhere and wait. I'm on my way. You don't get it. I... I can't wait anymore. This has something to do with what you were telling me before? It does. Well, I'll say one thing. There's always a way out. Here's what you need to do. You need to take a few deep breaths. Then rethink all this. Hard. And then you can call me back. Do you know why? Because I am here for you. She's but the best. End of discussion. Well played. Wouldn't let me get a word in edgewise. Probably for the best. Would have said too much anyway. Was good you called. Wish I'd have had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think. It all started in a fucking landfill. Yeah, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Hmm. I like the idea of him and Rogue going to kind of complete, you know, in a, in a roundabout way, something they tried to accomplish before. Uh, also, I think that his style would get things done, you know? Definitely don't trust Arasaka. I could ask Pan Am, but just... It seems too intense for that. I think you ought to go with Rogue. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know? Yeah, I think so. Just... Hold on a minute. I need to think. Hmm. Or just end it? Ah, it's a tough call. I don't know. I think we stick with our gut. You ought to go with Rogue. This feels to you to get right. the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. Bring us home, Johnny. Just, uh, go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, V. I'll get us through this. You'll see. See you on the other side. <laughs> burn this whole fucking city down. Wow. Look who we have. Yeah. Can you be real? You're the weirdest thing going on. Can you touch it? Can it be? Drop it one last drink before turning in. Can you be I'm just getting started. He's going to throw her off a bit. Oh, too bad. We're closing up. I'm looking for Rogue. Big booth over there, but you probably don't want to disturb her. No, I think I do. No, I'm serious. Should kick you in the can. Then what you think? Then just watch you. Oh, well, I'll watch, but I doubt I'll be the one to <laughs> We'll see. How you doing? Oh, she's talking about Kako. You're running a little operation only because I'm And I can change my mind. 
Talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Interrupted important biz, did I? Got a strange feeling this conversation could be more important. You think? You want something. And that's always a bad sign. Of course I do. Who better could I take it to? Out of that cool how you hear the voices layered. By some crazy I love that. Coincidence. Only you survive. How's that supposed to mean? Huh. Somehow missed the last 50 years. Just trying to get my facts straight. Fill in some gaps. And? You learn anything useful? Just that no one from our old crew got a happy ending. No one but you. I don't like the tone. This little bar in the middle of the screen is not distracting at all. Oh, what kids? We ain't finished yet. Oh, yes, you is. Sheesh, what's the matter? Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Told you, Claire. Bye bye. Okay. Guess I'm gonna go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves. Oh, next. Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? That my bottle behind the bar? Yep. Been waiting there. Just... I never knew what the fuck for. But I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might use it. <laughs> Okay, so we either insult her by saying you chose a cozy life, curious what it costs you, or let's see your cards. I think you You're sold out to the corpos. You're wasting my time. Chose a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. That Good what argument. You tell yourself when you cashing corp checks. That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. Well, hey, the past is the past. That's right. But that's not why you're here. You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. Hmm. I don't know if she cares enough about V. Sokka Tower is intriguing, though. Let's see. This body, I'm trying to... I'm not... Fuck. V's dying and I'm the fucking cancer killing him. But the process can be stopped. I just no, have to... Johnny. Don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you. So you can feel better. You sure about that? Yeah. <laughs> Same as it was with Alt. Yeah, I think she's probably right. It wasn't even about guilt, that. Just some fucking sense of personal discomfort. Oh, fuck off, princess. I'm running out of time, rogue. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of his head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. At Data Fort. Makoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Sokka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should have seen that coming. Yeah, you should have. Only an idiot does the same thing over and over while expecting things to work out differently. Well, technically, we'd probably do this a little differently, to be fair. You even have a plan for this? Haha. <laughs> You're the best fixer in town. You tell me how we're gonna do this. Love it. Did you say we? 
willing to miss out on this. This is big. She can't resist. <laughs> so cool. So what? I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. Just like the old days. When? <laughs> Dunno. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? Ooh. I feel like when we say you owe it to yourself, it comes across like disingenuous a little bit. Cause I think you know you owe me one. Me and everybody else you buried while you climbed to the top. Ooh. Shit. <laughs> Dirty. That one night, by some fucking miracle, you waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us, have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Oh, hello. Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. <laughs> Just stop talking. Oh, funny rogue. Easy peasy. <laughs> cool. Seems to be working. Where the hell are we now? I imagine this is like just montaging her planning things. So on the phone with somebody. Maybe we're passed out. I don't know. Whoa, what Fucking the Fucking Christ. <laughs> Every time. Every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over twenty hours. <laughs> over twenty hours. Afterlife. Okay. Next time you're losing teeth. Think so. I would like to see you try. But the boss will not be happy when I break your bones. Mean rogue. There's only one boss. Let's go. The boss awaits. Hmm. I'm just wondering if I can get rid of this little thing in the middle of the screen here, but it did go away. Now it's back. Next time I can save, I'll do it. This place is so cool and it's empty. I love it. Oh, behind the bar even. See you two said your hellos. Excellent. What is this Whoa, stuff? What's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Oh, is that right? Lighting up for 10 cigarettes. Our ride. So you're in. Don't act all surprised, Leadhead. <laughs> we knew she would join. over there. Help yourself. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Overture. Prejudice. Grab Bunch of ammo. Johnny. Don't forget. So is this in addition to the stuff that we're already carrying? I think it probably is. Retro thrusters. Very little armor. Fall damage reduction. Seems a bit weird. What are these? Retro thrusters. anti -grip. Oh, so we have a... them to your legs and you can jump from damn near any height. Okay. Christ, Johnny, I'm not your fucking babysitter. Never mind. Got it. Okay, now, gonna tell me what the plan is. Yep. Jack in the shard. Targets the Makoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then 
get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress, the most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. Stealth, I presume? First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti grabs Oh. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building. We use our retro thrusts again, reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. I mean, it's I'm impressed. Said, there's only one boss, one queen. Sheesh, didn't say you had a bomber. We all have our secrets. <laughs> Guess nowadays a slick red Musutani just doesn't cut it. How'd you get that? I'm the best fixer in town, idiot. Enough said. Now focus on the plan. Oh, we could doubt her, I wonder. Love the sentimentality of it. You know how much I love to blow shit up. But I don't think we're gonna survive in there. Soon as security's alerted, they'll call in spec ops. And that's about all she wrote. Definitely a fair point. No, she didn't. Here comes the tricky bit. We're gonna knock a Jerujan 0401 commsat off its orbit. Blood clock satellite. We gonna make history, friends. That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Whoa. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, no support, complete chaos. You need to tell me that apart from that fucking bomber, you have a weaponized space shuttle. Got a certain acquaintance at Orbital Air. Somebody you call in for a huge favor. Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. You mean old? Yup. Cool. Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. Contacts at Orbital Air, eh? You really are the queen of fixers. Better be grateful. Called on my best assets for you. It's clear that she pulled all the strings and called in all the favors that were possible. Brew all this up while I was asleep. Actually, I brewed it up while you were dead. A finger in the comms network pie when corp conflicts start to heat up again could be worth gold. Hmm. Because nothing stands to make you more eddies than more. Long term. Try to sway all, but no promises. Unfettered AI, remember? She can be difficult. Still got the watch on her ass, too. Besides, bringing down a satellite might not make her happy. I could give a shit about her feelings. I'm the one taking most of the risks here. Either you convince Cunningham or I'm out. I said I'd try. Christ. <laughs> so summing up, we fly to our socket tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of missiles. Exactly. Then we jump in, find the building's vertical axis, and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yep. And I guess is that where What'd we get in think? touch with Alt? See, just one problem. There's no coming back from this. You'll burn bridges. To ash and dust. Mm. All risky, but she's doing it. Gonna be gunning for you. Yeah, probably orbital air will too. But as I see it, they braided this whip that's gonna sting them. So, what do you think? <laughs> I don't know. It sounds too simple somehow. Forgot to mention our chances of survival are shit. Yeah, no, I figured that much. Still want it? I do. End of topic. Rogue. What? Just thank you. Thank me later. There's still the matter of alt. 
Do you know how to move around cyberspace? Well, V got some practice under his belt. Sure, I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. Oh, like a little training session. And you, Wayland, heat up the Strix. We'll be with you soon. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> <laughs> really funny, bro. Okay, let's see if we can get rid of this. This is cool. I, I, it's funny, like, you get into these end game scenarios and you always think about what all the other options could have done, like, you know, um, not taking the pills or trying to do it with Pan Am or whatever. Like, uh, this is so cool. I, like, I have no idea where this is going to go. 